I've been told that we will not have to watch this game in totality. Um, you'll see what I mean here in a second. It is the Golden State Warriors trying to do their darndest with a Cleveland Cavaliers team that is yet to lose this year. Nobody else can say they're undefeated as the former Cavalier Wiggins nails the shot and kick us off here. Isaac Okura. Uh, Cleveland is feisty. And their starting five is locked in as Mobley gets the block. Oh, look at this beautiful play. I want to give Cleveland some credit, man. I know Dan Gilbert's still holding things down. I know he's dealt with a lot of things in his personal life, but they didn't held this thing down. And they got a starting five that, in theory, you haven't seen the best basketball of them yet, right? Oh, my goodness. It is 20 to 2. Thank you, Wiggins. Was that a 20 0 run? He can't miss. Oh, Darius Garland on some of these finds. That is just great awareness to get that to Struz and Struz paying attention that low in the shot clock. Warriors better be careful. This thing almost over already before we got started. Mobley gets to deuce. 17 ain't. I'm not worried about 17. The Warriors got enough weapons to get back in this game. I'm worried about the fact that Cleveland's making open looks, contested looks. Oh, yeah. Cavs by 20 late in the first, but Jemski off the Kaminga for three. It's a good looking stroke by the young man. Yeah, he's really improved his game. Kaminga with some moments of hesitation finds Pajemski. Pajemski coming off a great rookie. Good dudes from Pajemski. Warriors trying to hang around while some of these Cavs starters get a break. They back out there now. Oh boy. Yeah, this is one of them nights, bro. Cleveland just off the one of them starts. You can tell these dudes, I don't know this to be fact, but when I hear stories about Dame and Giannis not working out together, does it really matter that Dame and Giannis didn't work out? I guess it could, but I think it speaks to something, right? Like it's, it maybe speaks to ego. It maybe speaks to where these guys are at in their relationship, right? It's not growing, right? Like, you could tell Cleveland, some of these guys got together and worked out this summer. I mean, we're freaking eight, nine games into the season, and these dudes know where they're, you know, and again, I know they played together for the most part. This nucleus has been together for a couple years now, but guys know where guys are going to be on the court. That's a beautiful thing to watch. This team is playing this thing the right way right now. It's a 30-point game. You damn near could just save Steph Body a game. You might as well say he DMP'd it. He boy's not missing. To open this game, they're all over the Warriors. 13 to 17 from the three-point line? He's been a lone bright spot. Huh? And the way they boys shooting over 75% from three. real slow dance to the hoop. Curry. He'll eventually curl down the lane. He flicks it up and in. On the wrong end of a 71-38 score. Oh, they about to get... Oh, oh my. Oh, Darius Garland. He's throwing some dimes in this game. Bro, DG is dying the ball all over the court. Allen grabs it, bounces. Akuro lays it in. Akuro getting 
track it down. He does. He'll zip it back to Allen. Allen takes his time. Now Garland. The shot clock is all the way down to three. Garland. Oh, my goodness, dude. Boy, Darius Garland is putting on a passing There's clinic right now. I want to see him get to 100 by halftime. 79 42 lead. Jerome once again throws. He'll find Garland. Garland with a good pump fake. Got Wiggins in the air. He coolly drops his through. They're already at 80. Franchise record with his head up. Oh, cookies. Lavert with a steal. Garland with a fake. Wow. The Cavaliers have held the war. What a pathetic performance from the Warriors in the first half and a great one from the Cavs. Second half. There is that pressure as Tate to the pass and he puts it up and in, draws the foul. Doing a good job of being ready to catch and shoot. That's what this offense is all predicated around. Wiggins off to Draymond. Got it. Steph Curry, 12 points. Wiggins, 11. John Dickamiga had a good game off the bench. He probably got a lot of minutes in this one because uh Mobley gets two feet in the paint. Sends it back to Mitchell. Mitchell to the elbow. Got it. Step back, baby. Mark Price. Whoo, buddy. Garland only has six assists. Three point shooter. That floater. Twenty-seven points for Garland. Mitchell only had twelve points. Didn't need much. Cavs are getting away from their system now. They're not. They're Mitchell not got in and out in 25 minutes. In the first half. This thing is just joining us over. Simply on fire from the field as Mitchell fires. He's got it. The Cavs had 14 of 22 triples. He picked up all four in the first half. He couldn't afford to reach in there on that play. Taking it inside. Cavaliers got the signals crossed. Mitchell works on Wiggins. Find some daylight. Allen grabs the weak side rebound. Deals to Garland. Garland's all alone and makes wow. no mistake. <laughs> I've, I've never seen him do that before. <laughs> Garland comes and gets it. His jump pass is tipped by Draymond. His, his defensive effort is picked up too. Buddy Heald. He's got it. Scoreline. 19 now for Garland. He's at four threes. Curry didn't want that one. Just to put in perspective, Cleveland got to 81 points at halftime. The Cavs ain't even at 70 yet. At the end of the, we almost the end of the third. From Looney puts it up and in. A circus shot by Jared Allen in an 82 game season. They playing with these boys right now. Kaminga lays it up and in. Recently, the Sixers. Steph and the Warriors had such a great game in Boston against the Celtics the other night. And maybe they invested everything in that one. They ain't having it in this one. You got to play better defense to win an NBA game like against this team right now. The way they're clicking. Yang now. He'll find Mitchell. They're out here with Merrill, Mobley, and Wade. Mitchell stumbles. Feeds back to Nia. Good pass inside. And guys is making the extra pass. Like, and puts it up and in. this looks like a really uh, a good team that likes and playing with each other. Pause. To finish it off. Oh, Evan Mobley works his way to the basket and cracks it home. Anderson snares the rebound. Elton's been good in the second half. He'll drive, put it up. But Jemski pokes it in. That's how well he handles the ball. Here's Garland again. Works through Anderson. Try to force that one into Allen. Got a couple Allen turnovers late here. In the second half. That's why he didn't get the two assists. It in, have scored and have at least one assist. And that's amazing, isn't it? Garland for three. You know, when we talk about. All right, this game is over, man. The Warriors lose by a lot. Cleveland gets a huge win. If you love flexing your sports knowledge, you should head over to the best place to play fantasy sports and win some money while you're at it. That's Underdog. For me, I love the pick em game. It's super simple to play, too. All you got to do is go to the Underdog website or app. You got to pick whether a player will have a higher or lower stat line for that specific game. You get your picks right, and you can win up to 1,000 times your money. And... When you sign up, if you use your boy's promo code, which is Ferro, your deposit will get matched up to $1,000. It's available to you in bonus cash. You can't beat that. Tap in with Underdog. My promo code is Ferro.